Okay, so this is uh, where I've got to so far with the swarm evaluation kit. You can see a picture of it uh, on the floor on the right hand side there. We've got the top open and we've got the swarm tile. And then beside it, you can see an OLED screen with um, a Feather S2, which has got an ESP32 S2 in it rather nicely. Um, and that comes with CircuitPython installed with a bunch of stuff, which is lovely. And what that means is that I can um, connect that up with a USB connector to my PC here. Um, and it then enumerates as um, both uh, a drive, so I can copy files to and from it, which is absolutely fantastic. And also I've got, um, I've got a, a serial port that I can use um, the CircuitPython terminal over, so that's kind of neat. Um, so what I've been doing is I have been adding MQTT support in so that we can um, more easily talk to this thing remotely when it's set up on my roof. And what we can do is if I uh, reboot the uh, feather now, it's going to start up and it's going to start running a modified version of the, of the code that I've put on it. Um, so it's now connecting over to my local network it's done of the Wi-Fi and it's connecting to um, one of the public MQTT brokers which it's also done and it's then subscribing on you see a topic there swarm eval kit and then the that's actually the MAC address of the, um, of the feather there so if I publish um, using one of the mosquito tools if I publish a hello world message to that topic immediately because that's how good MQTT is we get that received on the uh, development kit on the feather there and that's translated that into a command for the tile to send a message so what will happen now is that the next time one of the satellites in the constellation is overhead that will be squirted out over to uh, whatever endpoint I've got it got it set up for so that's kind of neat, isn't it? Yeah, you can see how that could be quite quite cool. Um, so I think that's probably enough for tonight. Let me know what you think. Thanks.